It's gonna be super exciting. There's freakly wee, bu fr fr freakly wee bundles. <laughs> What's up everybody and welcome back to another video. I waited way too long to make this video and now there's like a trash truck, a construction truck, and a FedEx truck down there making a whole lot of noise. Don't get me wrong, I appreciate everybody doing their jobs. <laughs> okay, sorry if it's loud. We have a lot of news to talk about and we're gonna go over it real fast because it's so exciting. First of all, hey, thank you to everybody who's been hanging out on streams. It has been so freaking fun. Come hang out, especially, especially tomorrow night. That is a big truck. Anyway, come, come hang out, especially tomorrow night, because we're going to be playing the new Pokemon Snap the moment that it gets released. So, come hang out on Twitch. It's been so fun. Thank you to everybody who's made it so special. I can't wait to keep going. Don't forget about the uh, giveaway in the YouTube channel as well. I will link that. It's one of the Pokeballs. It is a freaking awesome Pokeball. I'm going to be announcing that on Friday. Anyway, let's get into these announcements. First of all, market calendars for Pokemon Go Fest returning this July. It is a global event again. They don't give us many details. They give us this little teaser image, which is cool. Scyther, Meryl, Pikachu, Chespin, Woobat. I don't think there's anything hidden in the back, but we do have musical notes on the Go Fest uh, logo, which is cool. Stay tuned, right, for more details, uh, which is super cool. A lot of people think it's going to be the release of Meloetta. Right, so this is Meloetta. It is a mythical Pokemon that has to do with like music or sound, right? So, kind of makes sense. Cool looking Pokemon. I'm into it. Kind of sassy. Anyway, I'm super stoked, but mark your calendars because this is going to be July 17th and 18th, a two day event. I cannot be more excited for this. I am so, so stoked. Luminous Legends. Ah, Xerneas makes his Pokemon Go debut. This is so cool. So this is Xerneas. It is one of the uh, 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 regional. It is one of the legendary Pokemon from the Kalos region. Spritzy, Swirlix, and Gumi. Are you ready? New item, the Rainy Lure. This is so cool. So this event is happening from uh, May 4th to May 17th. Spritzy, Swirlix, and this is the Gumi family. So th these are dragon types, uh, which is really cool. The uh, <coughs> Gudra right here, right? is the, the third evolution, and what's cool is you're going to need to use one of the new items <laughs> to evolve it. Spritzy and Swirlix will be appearing more oft, uh, more frequently in the wild alongside other dragon and fairy type Pokemon like Dratini, Ralts, Bagon, Cottony, and if you're lucky, you might find a Gumi in the wild. The Rainy Lure makes a debut. This is going to attract Pokemon uh, such as Water, Bug, and Electric type Pokemon. Uh, when you're near one, you can evolve uh, Sligu, which is Gumi's evolution, into Gudra, the final evolution. What's also really cool and a new mechanic is that Sligu, 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 Sligu can also evolve into Gudra when it's raining out, so that's awesome. Complete event exclusive to field research to encounter fairy and uh, fairy type Pokemon, including Spritzy and Swirlix. Uh, receive a rainy lure as one of the rewards, which is cool. In seven kilometer eggs, you ready for this? Cleffa, Igglybuff, Azurel, Gibble, yes, Swirlix and Spritzy, I can't wait, this, this keeps getting better and better by the way. Psychic Dragon, a fairy type Pokemon like Galarian, Ponyta, Lolan, Executor, Xerneas, and Moral Bean Raids. Events exclusive field research tasks will lead to encounters with Psychic Dragon, fairy type, including Galarian, Ponyta, Gibble, Spritzy, and Swirlix, like, hold on, Gibble's all, all over this, but so is Galarian Ponyta. If any exclusive AR mapping tasks will lead to encounters with Galarian Ponyta, I love it. Dragonite and Salamence will be able to learn their uh, old Community Day moves, which are super exciting. That's awesome. You can use a TM or you can evolve into those. Here's, this is freaking nuts. So from Saturday the 1st to Sunday the 9th, you and other trainers worldwide need to catch 500 million fairy type Pokemon to unlock the bonuses that will be available from May 11th through the 17th. Ready for these? This is awesome. You will unlock 3 times Catch XP during that time. Pancham, right, will be making its Pokemon Go debut. And if you're lucky, you might find a Shiny Galarian Ponyta. Shiny Galarian Ponyta will be unlocked if we catch 500 million fairy types. And, don't worry, Shiny Galarian Ponyta will continue to be Shiny eligible even after the event, which is perfect. So this is, this is Pancham, uh, super, super cute, but uh, Shiny Galarian Ponyta. Anyway, of course, this is regular Galarian Ponyta, but this is Shiny Galarian Ponyta right there. 
Anyway, you can also look forward to the Luminous Legends Y event coming soon, which of course is going to be introducing Yveltal. And there's a theory online that's saying if we're getting shiny Galarian ponies off of the first half, maybe we'll get shiny Galarian Zigzagoon for the second half. <laughs> anyway, alright, we still have a lot to talk about. Let me move around for a sec. Okay, so we're gonna talk about what's going on uh, with the rest of May because there's a lot of exciting things going on. So first of all, Moltres is coming with Giovanni, shout out Moltres, right? The me the me search, <laughs> the May research breakthrough is gonna be Galarian Ponyta, which is so exciting for so many reasons. In the second half of May, obviously, as we now know, probably, right? Probably, it'll be shiny eligible, so I can't wait for that. Currently in raids, we have the incarnate forms of Tornadus Thunderous and Landorus until the 4th of May, they can be shiny, but from Tuesday, the 4th to the 18th, Xerneas is coming, oh my god, you can't wait, and then from the 18th to uh, June 1st, Eveltal. Mega Raids, right, they're going to be rotating ar around as well, so uh, until the 4th we're going to have Mega Venusaur, Low Pony, and Obama Snow, from the 4th to the 15th we're going to have Venusaur, Mega Charizard Y, and Low Pony, and then from the 15th to the 1st, Mega Ampharos, Mega Houndoom, and a surprise Mega Evolved Pokemon will be in Mega Rage. There is a rumor that it's going to be... Yeah, there's there's a rumor it's going to be Mega Aerodactyl, which is super cool. Um, so I guess we'll find out second half of May. And then in the spotlight, right, every Tuesday. So on May 4th, we'll have Cottony and Twice the Candy for Catching. On the 11th, we'll have Dratini, which is super exciting, especially if people are still looking for Dragon types. Uh, twice the Candy for Transferring. Uh, May 18th, Tuesday, we'll have Alolan Rattata, which is exciting because I love that shiny. Uh, you'll learn twice the XP for evolving, and then on the 25th, we'll have Meryl, and twice the Stardust for catching. So, here is why, it's right? This is Alolan Rattata shiny. I love this maroon color. I think we all know what Dratini looks like, but you know, always fun to look at. Such a great green. Hmm. Meryl also, if uh, you evolve through Azumarill, you know it's a great PvP Pokemon as well. So Community Day is going to be Saturday, May 15th, but they haven't told us what it's going to be. There is a rumor, I don't know, right? There's a rumor it's going to be Swablu, which is interesting because it's been a shiny that's been out for a long time and it only has, well, one evolution, really. Swablu and Altaria, so I wonder if that's going to be the case. Don't forget upcoming events. We actually starting tomorrow, right? Pokemon Snap Celebration, which will be going on until uh, May 2nd where there's going to be a lot of really cool things, including Shiny Smeargle. It's going to be super exciting. There's Freakly Wee, bu fr fr freakly wee Bundles. <laughs> Weekly free bundles that are going to include remote raid passes and more. A lot of really exciting stuff. I'm super stoked. I'm just, like, I, I, I'm, I'm so excited about Pokemon Snap. And, and then we have all this stuff to look forward to in, uh, oh my god, in Pokemon Go. Bet your bottom dollar we're going to be uh, shiny hunting that Galarian Ponyta like crazy. Oh, speaking of shinies, yo, we got this shiny the other day. Hold on. Yo, oh my god, shiny Tauros. Yo, I, I thought this was never going to happen. This is such a cool one. I freaking love it. I've tapped on so many Tauros. So anyway, super, super, super excited about this. Um, I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. I was super duper excited. But anyway, so let me know what you're most excited about. Also, don't forget, don't forget, we're going live. Um, on Twitch, right, tomorrow night, we're gonna hang out, and as soon as Pokemon Snap is released, we're gonna be playing that, and I'm super duper stoked. We are also going to, of course, have a big TCGA celebration on the 30th at uh, 8 p.m. EST, I believe. But anyway, long story short, it's gonna be a really fun weekend, so come join us on Twitch. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much for hanging out here. Thanks for hanging out on Twitch. Let me know what you're most excited about, and I uh, can't wait to see you soon. I'm Light Screen, and I'll catch you later. Ow, my legs! <laughs>